Hello. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Yeah, I'm all right. How are you? Very good, very good. So, uh... Went out to razors at your neck of the woods? Oh, yeah. No, I'm going for a sort of a, um... I'm trying to do a lot of writing at the moment. I think I'll look more like a writer if I do this. So, uh, did you get this phone call from Richard Curtis? I didn't take it. I, um... Did, you, did he call you? Yeah, but I always, I always put it straight to message, cos it's always asking for something. Did you answer? Well, I didn't know it was him. I mean, obviously, I... I try and avoid him, cos he's always... I mean, if he's calling, it's to say, will you do this thing for comic relief normally, or sport relief, or whatever relief it is. Yeah, it'd be a relief um, if he stopped calling. It would be a relief if he stopped calling. Uh, unfortunately, it was number withheld. I picked up the phone uh, and he was on the other end. And then I was he t and I was trapped. What did he say? He wants us to do something together. I said I'd give you a call and... Uh, yeah, so he wants us to do something. So, I mean, when this is all over the, and people are saying... It's like the Second World War. People are saying, what did you do during the war, Daddy? I watched all of Tiger King in two nights. That's, you have to show you made some sort of effort. If we do this thing for uh, Richard Curtis, at least we can say we did I, our... I, cla I clap on a Thursday. You do what? I go out and clap on a Thursday. But can anyone see you doing it? Yes. Well, I wouldn't do it otherwise. Yes, I go outside, we go out into the street, we all clap. What I found now is that as the weeks go by, there's a great pressure to not be the first one to stop. Look, I, I think we should come up with some sort of thing where you maybe do uh, Bryn from uh, Gavin and Stacey and I'll do Alan Partridge and maybe, I don't know, um, Alan rings up Bryn... No, Bryn uh, gets Alan's number and asks Alan if he'll do a charity show or something. But, um, this is at the top of my head, I've no idea. It sounds terrible. Have you shot a few neighbours yet? Have I shot a few neighbours yet? No, have you shopped? No, she, of course not. But I dare say, if, this, if, we're, still, if we're still here a year from now, mm. then have you shot a few neighbours this week? Will be a legitimate question. Terrifying, but uh, we're going to go back to, to sort of medieval times. Society will break down, and uh, we'll return to a feudal uh, system of barons and knights. I imagine I might be a, a baron. I'd yeah. try and, you know, organise a co some sort of commune to, uh, you know, to, to to farm the land. Who would the knights be? I don't know, Julian Fellows. The Downton Abbey guy. Oh um, no, you want you, you want your, your show business knights. Tom Jones would be a knight, wouldn't he? I'm roaming the countryside, huh? Do... Just making sure everything, huh, is all right. Or Sir Mick Jagger. We've got to organise ourselves into workers' cooperatives to share out the spoils of our agricultural system, and don't forget to rotate the crops. <laughs> And then you need to stockpile in case there's a blight. Let's spend the blight together, yeah? Let's spend the blight together. Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't think it matters if we do something that's not especially funny. I, you know, I'm, I'm not, it's not like I'm just sitting around. I've been delving, I've been taking food to people. Have you yeah? seriously? A few neighbours, not, not many, but yeah, I've been doing my bit. You didn't yeah, take, I, you I, didn't I, take yeah, money yeah. for it, I hope? You refused the money? Said, absolutely not, just make a small donation to uh, a charity and... Um, tell people about it. And tell people about it. Right, let's, I'm, I am losing the will to live now. There must be enough stuff for three minutes in this. At the end, I'm going to go back to my reading. OK. Right. I'm just thinking, what's a funny thing for me to go back to be reading? So, no, I've got it, I've got it. I'll go, um... All right, well, look, it's been very nice uh, uh, catching up with you. Stay safe, OK? I'm going to, I'm going to go and clean my glasses. Okay, and we'll speak right. soon. OK. I'm just going to get back to my book. That was created as part of the Big Night Inn. We hope you enjoyed it. We also hope that if you possibly can, you can follow the link and make a donation. Right now, up and down the United Kingdom, charities are providing urgent help to people who really need it most. So if you've got a couple of quid, bung it in. Please help. Thank you.